China has a long history in bridge construction. The oldest bridge still in existence in China is the Anji Bridge, constructed during the years between 595 and 605. During the infrastructure boom of the past two decades, bridge building has proceeded at a rapid pace on a vast scale. Prior to the completion of the Wuhan Yangtze River Bridge in 1957, there were no bridges across the Yangtze River, China's longest, from Yibin to Shanghai, and all overland roads and railways crossing this 2,884 kilometers, 1,792 miles, stretch of the river had to be ferried. There were only seven such bridges in 1992, but that number reached 73 by the end of 2012, including eight new openings in that year alone. China's reform and opening up, along with the accompanying economic development, has brought unprecedented opportunities for the development of bridge engineering in China, resulting in a continually increasing scale of bridge construction. More than 830,000 bridges were built in China by the end of 2017. China is recognized for its bridge engineering due to a number of world-renowned bridge projects that have had significant international impact. China's bridges account for more than half of the world's top 10 bridges under each category. The brilliant achievements of the Chinese bridge industry have been widely recognized by society. Bridges have become one of the most important brands in China's infrastructure construction, and international recognition of Chinese bridges is continually increasing. China has been pushing the boundaries of bridge construction with many record-breaking bridges, including the Danyang Kunshan Grand Bridge, the world's longest bridge measuring over 164 kilometers, 102 miles. The Yangtzegang Yangtze River Bridge in Wuhan, the third longest suspension bridge span. The Hadong Yangtze River Bridge in Jiangsu Province, the second longest cable state span. The Duj Bridge, the highest bridge in the world. The Pingnan Third Bridge, ZH, the longest arch bridge span. China possesses the construction and control technologies for various types of bridges under different construction conditions. And the industrial technologies for construction are developing rapidly, with constant improvement in terms of the automation level, production efficiency, and quality stability. The majority of the main construction equipment used in bridge construction is made in China. The automation level and equipment production capability have also improved significantly. In terms of construction technology and equipment for super-high bridge towers, developments include Hydraulic climbing formwork technology for concrete bridge towers, super-high concrete pumping technology, construction technology for prefabrication and hoisting, and high-precision assembly for steel bridge towers. In terms of the construction technology and equipment of the main girder, developments include Digitalized manufacturing production lines for steel box girders, precasting and erection technology for monolithic concrete girders, girder conveyance. An erection on constructed girders, precasting and assembling construction technology using the short matching method, construction technology for lifting a steel box girder as a whole. Major girder erection and construction technologies with a riding cable crane, the bridge deck crane, and incremental launching and sliding formwork. Key equipment such as the floating crane, bridge erecting machine, bridge deck crane, riding cable crane, large gantry crane, and sliding formwork equipment have been developed independently. The lifting capacity of the riding cable crane, 900T, and its rotating construction technology, a rotating body length of 198M and a rotating body weight of 22400T, are at an internationally advanced level. In terms of cable manufacturing and installation technologies and equipment, developments include hot extruded polyethylene protective cable technology for cable stayed bridges and the formation technology of a hot extruded cable sheath. Super long stay cable erection technology with a soft hard combination and three stage hauling has been developed and is widely used in cable stayed bridges and arch bridges. Main cable installation technology using the prefabricated parallel wire strand, PPWS, method has been learned. In terms of construction technology and equipment for arch ribs, developments include construction technologies such as cable stayed suspension and connection with cantilever assembling and cantilever casting, stiffening technologies for rib skeletons, reinforced concrete arch bridge rotation, and lifting technologies for large sections of steel arch bridges. For example, the main span of the Beipanjiang Bridge on the Shanghai Kunming Railway that was built using the stiffening skeleton construction method is 445 m long, which is far longer than bridge spans in foreign countries, the greatest of which is 210 m. 
The three-stage continuous vacuum-assisted pumping method has been adopted in the stiffening skeleton encased concrete casting technology in order to improve the conveyance efficiency to 30.8 M3H-1. The main span of Koyoshinman Bridge, which was built using the technology of cantilever assembling erection through cable state suspension, is 552 M. Using the construction method of arch rib rotating, the maximum lifting tonnage by the horizontal rotation method is 17300 T, and a vertical rotation method has also been developed. The maximum lifting weight by the large section lifting method is 2800 T. Construction equipment such as the large tonnage cable crane, with a maximum lifting weight of 420 T and a height of 202 M, has been developed. Furthermore, the arch rib construction technique is becoming increasingly common in the industry. In terms of construction technology and equipment for bridge foundations, developments include the large diameter board pile, large diameter steel pipe pile, pre-stressed high-strength concrete, PHC. Pipe pile, steel pipe composite pile, large pile group foundation, large caisson foundation, and super deep underground continuous wall foundation. Bridge construction equipment such as the pile driving ship, hydraulic piling hammer, drilling machine, concrete mixing ship, and double slot milling machine have been developed independently. The capacity of the pile driving ship, 7M, pile length over 100M, weight of 600T, has exceeded that of similar ships in foreign countries, example, 2.5M, pile length of 80M, weight of 100T. In terms of bridge erection technologies, industrial construction technologies are developing rapidly, and the automation level is constantly improving. For the erection of structural elements, integrated driving of the precast pile foundation, pre-assembly of the cap and pier body, and integral lifting of the prefabricated steel bridge tower have been achieved. For the main girder, large-scale precasting and erection technology has been realized for all operations, including the prefabrication and assembling of small sections of concrete box girders. Prefabrication and lifting of big sections of truss girder, integral erection of super-large sections of the steel box girder over waterways, and erection of the precast concrete main girder by means of a bridging machine. Automated erection has been applied from the upper structure to the substructure. Furthermore, technology promoting the rapid repair and replacement of large bridge sections has been developed for upgrading old bridges in order to minimize the interference of construction on busy traffic. In terms of construction control technology, the unstressed state control method for staged forming has been developed to solve the segmental construction of bridges. Based on the conventional double control of deformation, internal force, and combining with the geometric control method proposed by the concept of unstressed state control. Besides, a geometric control method has been proposed for the entire process of the design, manufacture, and unstressed member installation. This has greatly improved the construction control accuracy of long span cable stayed bridges. A construction control system that integrates functions such as calculation, analysis, data collection, instruction emitting, error judgment, and more is currently under development. Intelligent and information based construction control technology for bridges based on networks is becoming the focus of research in this field.